Happy Halloween, ladies and gentlemen. We're back today with another video. Uh, I really want to do something for Halloween because I don't typically, which is weird. I've been doing the channel for a couple years now. I haven't really done like a Halloween special per se. I've done a couple Halloween-like things, but today we're going to be drawing my favorite, uh, f my favorite horror franchise and also Halloween film, Halloween. Uh, the one and only Michael Myers, um, fun, fun fact, Michael Myers and I have the same birthday, uh, I don't know if that's cool or not cool, but, you know, take that as, as it might be. Anyway, uh, so I want to kind of talk about a couple of things that I was doing while I was, uh, drawing this, um, so the main thing that I was trying to keep in mind is just the personality of the character, um, and I know a lot of the times it's, it's kind of easy to... Especially because I have such, a, I, I think, I think a distinct style when I when I draw. It's kind of easy to lose that because the way that I draw jaws is very particular. The way that I draw ears is very particular, and the same thing with noses. So for this, I actually changed my style a little bit um, because it, it, I, I knew that it wouldn't really work right. Um, so for instance, my jaws are always really sharp really straight and really clean michael's mask is not that way so i had to change it up and the main thing that i was going for is i was really just trying to capture michael i was just trying to make sure that it was like him that was the most important thing to me um so i kind of sacrificed a couple of things and the, what you'll see me do um through a lot of this is i draw to many people kind of weird so i'll do things in 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 a, in a quote-unquote strange order so i kind of I, i'm adding details i added details on his face before i even drew his arms you know before i finished his torso um i just had the guide in there the guide of the torso i i i, I kind of do things as i see them so one of the things that i want to say is don't get caught up you know be like oh i gotta draw the whole thing first then i gotta go back and add details draw in the order that you like it, it always makes things easier for me at least anyway um and I'm going, ahead, I'm going ahead and doing the line art now. So, like I said, I, I was drawing this for fun because, like I said, I love Michael. I love Halloween. Uh, it's great films. But the thing is, is that I was like, you know what? This will be a this will be a, a fun Halloween video for Halloween. Um, so I was like, we'll just we'll just do this. This will be fun. Um, but uh, what else did I want to say? Oh, uh, my style's very simplistic. And I love that because I don't like detailed art. And I've said this multiple times. I don't like shading. I don't like doing that stuff. It's not because I can't or just like don't feel like it. it it's just because I just don't like the way that it looks, honestly. I, I mean, even like if something was hyper realistic or it's like extremely well painted, I just like, oh, that's nice art. It's great. But like, I'm just not into it that much. Um, it's just, the likability of it for me is just not very high. And I don't know why. It just is. So um, all my stuff tends to be more... Um, kind of kind of flat, you know, it's just it's just I like doing the base colors the line art the base colors and then um, Highlights I just like doing the highlights the rim lights to make it really pop and that's it I don't like doing anything else. That's completely it. Um, sometimes I, I might sell shade something very Like on occasion, it'll be very very small percent of the time that I'll actually sell shade something if you don't sell shading It's pretty much just like shading but flat. It's like the, the edges are hard like it's like sunlight like hard edged light um but it's a shadow of course so i might do that sometimes in very particular situations but just to build a shape i'll never do it to the shape well i just i'll do it just to build a shape like not to actually shade something so like for instance if i needed to depict um someone as very skinny very skinny and like they have a super bony face um then i i'm i'll sh i might shade the sides of their jaw to make it seem like their face is skinnier than it is or like i'll do this with the nose sometimes like i i was gonna do this with michael's nose in this in this piece but i might shade the bottom of the nose so it looks like there's actually like a bottom side to the nose but like i didn't do it i didn't even do it today very specific times i'll do that um i'll always do my double edge line thing and what i want to talk about is um i had a couple of times i've said i talked about this before but starting a piece is like awkward it always is and i don't know why it's always awkward for me because um i always draw heads first and that's the easiest thing for me to draw heads first which i'll circle then i'll go ahead and i'll draw the 
I'll draw like a little triangle underneath. And it's always awkward because I know I'm drawing Michael. You know, I'm not drawing. I know I'm drawing Michael. I know what pose I really kind of want to go for. Maybe I knew that I wanted to have his head tilted because that's very Michael like, you know. Um, but what I didn't know is I didn't know everything else because I don't like blocking things. Out. I like going with the flow, which I think is the best way to, to go about things. So I kind of just went with the flow and I ended up with this nice, you know, pose where he's just kind of staring and looking at the us you know which is good because that's exactly i like i said i was trying to just get his personality down more than anything um but uh but yeah that's very important to kind of in my opinion just go with the flow i don't like getting in there and, and saying hey i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do this i just kind of like having an idea and just going with it uh but yeah that's gonna be pretty much it for this so i'm pretty much done after this i got to do the highlights and then you know after that it's pretty much done but like i said i hope you guys have a fantastic halloween i love michael myers i love halloween in general have a very safe halloween um you know ha stay home have some fun at home watch some movies do some fun stuff um it's uh it's gonna be weird but it'll be great anyway but yeah stay safe have fun watch halloween watch halloween <laughs> <laughs> watch Halloween. Go watch Halloween. Don't watch Halloween 3, but watch all the rest of them. And, you know, the ones from 2007 as well. Don't watch those either. But anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. <laughs> I will see you in the next one. Peace out. But until then, bye-bye.